thank you for coming to your space. Whether your space is here or your space is there, thank you. I see you and acknowledge what it took to get here. The theme of today's practice is going to be taken from Melody Beattie's Journey to the Heart. And the section for today, set yourself up for a few words. The section for today is titled, Find Neutral Ground. There's a town in Idaho, Lava Hot Springs, that overflows with quiet, inexpensive hostels offering hot mineral water soaks to all who pass through. Folklore has it that in days long past, warring tribes would put aside their differences when they came here to soak in the waters and heal. This sacred ground was neutral territory. Although most of us are not at war with another tribe or even another person, many of us have been at war with ourselves. I have spent years judging myself and my experiences. As I have opened up to my emotions, I have spent time and energy judging those too. Often I expend as much energy judging and labeling the experience or emotion as I do living through it. I have run in terror from grief. I have attacked myself repeatedly for experiencing anger. I have put antagonistic labels on guilt and fear. Now I am learning the power of neutrality. It speeds my growth process, the time it takes to learn my lessons. If what I'm going through isn't wrong, then I am free to have the experience and embrace its lessons. <clears throat> Neutrality brings peace and the freedom to learn. As we continue our journey, the journey of the soul, we can learn to find the peace offered by neutral territory. We let ourselves have our experiences, the ones we have chosen, the ones we've created, and the ones we've been given. We let each burst of energy we need to feel, we let each burst of energy we need to feel pass through without judgment. Good or bad? I don't think so, just energy. We learn to let others have their emotions and lessons too. Discover the power of neutral territory. It is sacred ground that can help you heal. So the physical focus of today's class will be our feet. Downward facing dog. Come into downward facing dog. And look at your toes, your big toes, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, baby tiny pinky toe. Lift your toes, spread your toes, <clears throat> and place them back down. And can you discern your pinky toe, the feeling under your pinky toe from the pinky, from the feeling under your big toe? Good. Everybody take a huge breath in. Let it go. Inhale. Exhale. Walk your feet to your hands. Take ragdoll pose. And ground your heels down. Ground the mound of your big toe down. Yeah, and lift your 10 toes and spread them. Good. Good. Rock back and forth from the ball of your foot to the heel. Good. Extended mountain, reach up, root your feet down, lift your hands up. Take your hands to heart center. Lift all 10 toes. Yeah, spread all 10 toes. Good. We'll begin with the sound of three ohms. Oh, Keep your toes lifted, reach for the ceiling, look up, inhale, exhale, forward fold. 
Halfway lift, breathe in. Hands to your mat, high push up to low push up. Press all of your toes, yeah, tippy toes, low push up. Upward facing dog, press the tops of your feet down. Good, everybody, downward facing dog. Good work. Look at your feet, see your feet. In order to find neutral ground, it helps to get connected to where you're standing, what your feet are doing, feeling your feet. Because when you feel your feet, then you can begin to feel everything else. Breathe in, breathe out, look forward, jump your toes to your hands. Halfway lift, good. Forward fold, extended mountain, reach up, press your feet down, reach up, so good. Forward fold, let it go. Halfway lift, inhale, hands to your mat, vinyasa. Connect your brain to your feet, feel your toes. Up dog, press your toes down. Downward facing dog, see your toes. Good, fill up. Empty out. Do that again. Let all your air go. Look forward, jump. Yes, halfway lift, so good y'all, forward fold. Extended mountain, lift your toes, lift your hands, fold forward, let it go. Halfway lift, vinyasa, mind on your toes, so good Jessica, yes. High to low, yes Destiny, up dog, toes press down, downward facing dog, good Jess, mm-hmm. Everybody fill up, everybody empty, look forward, jump. Jump, yes, halfway lift, forward fold. Lift your toes, lift your fingers, lift your eyes. Fold forward, exhale, good. Halfway lift, inhale, vinyasa high to low. Up dog, toes press down, downward facing dog, check in with your toes. Good, Robin, mm-hmm, breathe in. Breathe out, bend your knees, jump. Yes, Noel, halfway lift, so good, Sarah, forward fold. Lift your toes, lift your eyes, extended mountain. Yes, Ruby, forward fold, let it go. Halfway lift, vinyasa. Mindful of your toes, high to low, so good, Jen, yes. Up dog, press them down, downward facing dog, check in with your toes. See them at the back of your mat. Bend your knees, look at your thumbs. Jump. Halfway lift, yes, Jen. Forward fold. Extended mountain, lift your toes, lift your eyes. Forward fold, good work. Halfway lift. Vinyasa, high to low. Mind of your toes, high to low. Good, Robin, up dog. Mm -hmm. Downward facing dog. Inhale. Exhale. Another breath in. Get ready, empty out. Take your toes to your hands, jump. Yeah, halfway lift. So good, forward fold. Bring your big toes to touch for chair pose, thunderbolt. Lift all 10 toes. Now put your weight back in your heels. Spread all 10 of your toes and sit deeper. Yes, for five. One, two, three. Keep spreading your toes, so good, Jimmy. Four, five, forward fold. Good work, halfway lift, vinyasa high to low. <clears throat> Up dog, toenails press down. Good, Sarah. Downward facing dog. Warrior one, right side. Step your right foot forward. And to begin, lift the toes on your right foot. Lift the toes on your right foot for five. One, two, three, four, five. Place your toes down. Lift the heel of your right foot for five. One two, three, four, 
five, vinyasa high to low. Good work, getting really connected to what our feet are doing and the power of our brain to make our feet do what we command, right? What we think. Warrior one, left side. Step forward, lift your toes, create your warrior one. One, two, three, four, five. Toes down, heel up. One, two, yes, destiny. Three, four, five. Vinyasa, high to low. Yeah. Upward facing dog, toes down. Downward facing dog, see your feet, check in with your toes, take a breath in. Let it go. Take your toes to your hands, jump. Halfway lift, yes, forward fold. Chair pose, toes up. One, two, three, four, five. Toes down, heels up. One, two, three, four, five. Forward fold, good work. Halfway lift, flow. Flow, high to low, toes. Connect to your toes, press them down, see them. Take warrior one, right side. Toes up, one, two, three, four, five. Heel up, one, two, three, four, five. Vinyasa, good work, y'all. Good work. Up dog, down dog. Warrior one, left foot forward. Land your foot, finding neutral ground through toes up. One, two, three, four, five. Toes down, heel up. One, two, three, four, five. Vinyasa, good. High to low, up dog, down dog. Bend your knees and take your toes to your hands. Jump, halfway lift, forward fold, chair pose. And here, toes lightly touching the earth, lightly lay them down, lay them down. Ground down through the four corners of your feet. And feel that solid connection between the soles of your feet and the floor and sit your hips lower, lower, lower. Good, take a breath in, look up. Vinyasa, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Warrior one, right side. Ground the four corners of your right foot into the earth. The big toe mound, the center of your right heel. Press down. Send your eyes up. Down through your right foot, eyes to the ceiling. Here, take a huge breath in. Vinyasa, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Warrior one, left foot forward. Create a firm connection, four corners of your left foot. Send your eyes up, dig your left foot down. Good, eyes to the ceiling, breathe in. Vinyasa, breathe out. Inhale, up. Good, Jen. Exhale down. Bend your knees, jump to the top of your mat. Halfway lift, forward fold. Thunderbolt chair pose, and do something with your feet that gets you grounded and connected, that allows you to tune into how you're standing, how your feet are supporting you. Good, Robin, I like that one foot and chair. We're here for five, one, two, three, four, five, forward fold. Good, Ruby, halfway lift, vinyasa. Yeah, connecting to your feet, what they're doing, where you're placing them, up dog, down dog, warrior one, right side. And create your warrior one to find your neutral ground. An extreme position is toes up, an extreme position is heels up. Find neutral groundedness in your feet. 
for five. One, two, three, four, five. Vinyasa flow. Good work, y'all. Mm -hmm. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Warrior one, left foot forward. Create a neutral ground through your feet. Feel all the corners of your two feet. Send your eyes up and then feel your feet without looking at them. One, two, three, four, five. Vinyasa high to low. Up dog, down dog. Lift your right leg. And before we go anywhere, flex your right foot. Look back and see the toes on your right foot and point them towards the floor. Dropping your right hip a lot. Connect to the toes on your right foot. You can see them. Now, from here, bend your knee, right knee. Stack your right hip up and over and flip your dog. Bring your right foot to the floor. And without looking at your feet, press them into the earth. And we're here for five. One, two, three, four, five. Side plank. Right hand down. Bottom knee can be lowered or, or lifted. Connect to your feet. Feel your toes, all ten of them. Lift your top leg. Spread the five toes on your top leg. One, two, yes, three, four, Five, downward facing dog, good work. See your toes, check in with your toes. Lift your left leg. So good, y'all, yeah, you can see your toes. Bend your knees, stack your hips, and flip your dog, or stay. Spread the toes, if you're staying, spread the toes on your left foot. If your feet are grounded, lift your hips higher. Yes, one, two, three, four, five. Side plank, opposite side. Create your side plank <clears throat> from your feet. Top leg lifts, spread the toes on your top leg. No matter how high it's lifted, spread all of your toes. One, two, three, <clears throat> four, Five, downward facing dog. Recheck in with your toes. Good work, y'all. Good work. Step your right foot forward for crescent lunge from a new space of awareness of your feet. Crescent lunge. And as you're setting up your crescent lunge, you're getting into your feet. Yes, lift your toes, lift your heel. Get really, really rooted into what your feet are doing. And can you feel what your feet are doing without looking at them? So I invite you to close your eyes or look at the ceiling. Feel your toes. Feel what your toes are doing. Lower your hips and see what happens in your feet. Good. We're here for five. One, two, three. So good, Sarah. Four. Yes, Noel. Five. Twist to the right. And renew the connection to your feet. And now that we're here and we're twisting, so good, Dev. Yes, Destiny. Mm -hmm. Good work, Jen and Jessica. Yeah, get connected to your feet. Yes, good. Warrior two. Yeah, wiggle your feet to create warrior two feet. Good, Jimmy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Good. Press your right knee towards your right pinky toe. Sit low. Good. Reverse your warrior, ground your feet down, lift your hand up and back. Extended side angle. And connect to what your feet are doing. Press the left pinky toe foot away, down and away. 
One, two, three. Bend more into your right knee. Good, Destiny. Five, vinyasa. High to low. Up dog. Good, Jimmy, I see that. Downward facing dog. Crescent lunge, left foot forward. A fresh opportunity to send your eyes to the ceiling, send your eyes closed, connect to your feet through sensation. What can you detect in your feet? How can you feel your feet? You send them signals to ground down. You send your toes signals to be soft, to be light. Yeah, feel what happens. Hands to heart center, twist to the left. Feel your toes. Good, keep breathing. Warrior two. From your feet up, warrior two. Keep breathing, loud ujjayi breathing. Like I know you're concentrating on your toes. Fill the space with the sound of your breath. Connecting to your feet. So strong, y'all. Reverse your warrior. Connecting to your feet, lift up and back. Yes, Sarah. Mm -hmm. Extended side angle. From your feet, right foot, the pinky toe edge, press it down and away. Ground down the four corners of your left foot. And press your left knee towards your left pinky toe. Good, Jen. Mm -hmm. Vinyasa, high to low. See your toes, high push up, low push up, up dog, down dog. Take a breath in while you're looking at your toes, make some noise, sigh it out, let it go. Do that again. Bend your knees. Take your toes to your hands, jump. Heck yes, heck yes, forward fold. Extended mountain. Hands to heart center. Chair pose. Good, twist to the right. Good, feel your toes, feel your feet. Creating neutral feet, groundedness in your feet. For five, open your arms if that's your jam. One, two, three. So good, Destiny. Four, yes, Dev. So good, Jen. Fold. Yes. Chair pose. Hands to center, twist left. Feeling your feet. Yeah. One, two, three. Bit lower, four, yes, Jen, five, forward fold. Halfway lift, vinyasa, high and low. Inhale, up dog, exhale, down dog. Bend your knees, seeing your toes, switch your gaze to your thumbs, take your toes to your thumbs, jump, halfway lift, forward fold, extended mountain, hands to heart center, set your eyes out in front of you, and put your mind in your toes, and take eagle, right leg up and over, with a special concentration on your feet, feeling, waking your right foot up, 
Good, making sure that your right foot is fully participating in Eagle Pose. Good, yes, we're here for five. One, two, three, four, five, switch. Good work, y'all. I see a lot of live feet in this space. Left side, up and over, left foot's alive. Awake, one, two, three, four, five, switch. Second set. With your attention on what your right foot is doing, one, two, three, mm -hmm, four, five, switch. Left foot, one, two, heck yes, three, mm -hmm, four, five, release. Standing leg raise. Again, put the spotlight of your attention onto your right foot. Take your shin in your hand. <clears throat> right hand, right shin. Wake up your right foot. Yes, Ruby, yes, yeah, so good. Flex your right foot. Open, open your right leg out. Look to the left. Wake up your left hand in relation to your right foot. Good. Come back to center. Kick your right foot forward. See your right toes. See the toes on your right foot. Spread them. Yeah, so good. I see everybody's feet alive on Zoom. Mm-hmm. Spread your toes. Airplane, right foot back. Keep that foot alive. Keep the toes awake. Press those awake toes away from the top of your head. Breathe in and breathe out. Yeah, so good. Breathe in and breathe out. Hands to heart center. Half moon, left hand down. Keep your right foot awake. Right foot awake, toes spreading, foot flexing. Good work, everybody. One, two, lift your right leg higher. Yes, Jen, I see that. Three, four, five, release. Yeah. Turn yourself around in a circle, wiggle your toes, shuffle them around, reset your feet, reset, yes, and then come to the top of your mat. Standing leg raise, left side. Take your shin, wake up your foot, boom. Wake up your foot, mm -hmm. yes. Open to the left, look to the right. Make your right hand as awake as your left foot. Yes. Come back to center. Kick your left toes out, left foot to the front of the space. Yes, so good, Dev. Spread the toes on your foot. Yes, Destiny. Yes. Airplane, left foot back, alive, awake, toes spread, creating distance between your foot and your head. Heck yes. Half moon, right hand down. Keep your left foot alive. Keep it alive, awake. Your left foot is fully present. Lift your top leg, left leg higher. Oh yes, one, two, three, four, five, release. Good work. Dancer, right side. Reach down with your right hand, grab the inside of your right foot. And feel your right foot. Wake it up. Yes, so good. Wake up the toes on your right foot and kick, kick. One more giant kick. Good work. Switch sides. Good, from your toes, left hand, left foot. Left foot, you can feel it in your hand, wake it up. 
Wake up your left foot and send it to the ceiling. Kicking. 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 Good work. Change sides. Good work. Right hand, right foot. And take dancer, land it in your body. Take dancer to your edge, find your edge. And then put your attention on your left foot, lifting your toes, lifting your heel. Send your attention from your right foot down to your left foot and get connected to what your left foot is doing. Lift your toes or lift your heel until you fall out. Good. Switch sides. Switch sides. Left hand, left foot. Your left foot is alive. Take dancer big. And then shift your attention to your right foot. Right foot on the ground. Lift your heel, lift your toes. Keep alternating, connecting to what your right foot is doing until you fall out of dancer. Good. Yes. Good. Good. Good work. Yes, if you need to do another pirouette at the top of your mat, do a 360, shake your toes out. Do that to get regrounded to your feet. Tree pose. Tree pose. Connect your right foot to your left ankle, your left calf. And my invitation is for you to keep your attention on your feet. Close your eyes or lift your eyes to the ceiling, shifting your gaze away from your feet. Feel your feet. One, two, three, four, five. Switch. From your feet, the soles of your feet. Create your tree, feel your feet. One, two, mm -hmm. three, four, five. Good work. Make your way to the top of your mat. Extended mountain, root your feet down, reach your hands up, breathe in, fold forward, breathe out. Oh, so good. Halfway lift. Vinyasa high to low. Inhale up. Exhale down. Triangle, right foot forward. Good, Noel. Yes. From your feet, ground your feet down and pull energy up through your feet, your shins, your knees, your thighs, hips, torso, chest, arms, fingers. Everybody take a breath in. Everybody let it go. Do that three more times. Breathe in. Again. Again. Side facing wide legged forward fold. Point your toes to the left. Drop your head. Take your feet out wide. You can see your toes. Wiggle them. Get connected to what your feet are doing. How they're supporting you.
pyramid pose. Right toes point forward, back foot wide. Yeah, and shorten your back foot, bring it about halfway up your mat and point your left toes towards the top corner of your mat. Yes, dig your feet down. Good, send your eyes to your left big toe. See your toes, what are they doing? Are they soft, are they gripping? Breathe in and breathe out. Good. Twisting triangle, feel your feet. Feel your feet in twisting triangle and twist to the right, right hand to the ceiling. Feel your feet. Keep pressing your heels down. Yeah, so good, Jen. Mm -hmm. Yes, Jessica. So good, Jimmy. Mm -hmm. Everybody. One, two, three, four. Yeah, good, Robin. Five. High to low. High to low. Feel your feet. High to low. Feel your feet up, dog. Press them down. Good, Jen. Yes, Noel. Downward facing, dog. So good, Robin. Ooh, yes. Left foot forward, triangle. Take a wide stance front to back. Yeah, left fingers down, right fingers reach. Ruby, take your back foot parallel to the short edge of your mat, yes, and take a longer stance. Mm -hmm. Feel your feet, good, yeah, feel your feet. Good, yeah, so good. Make your feet alive and make your right hand alive. Spread the fingers, yes, on your right hand, so good. One, two, three, uh-huh, four, five, come up to standing. Side facing wide legged forward fold. If you'd like to bind your hands, if you'd like to take goddess squat, do that from your feet. Connect to this pose from your feet. Good, Robin. Good. Tuning in to what your feet are doing, how they're supporting you. So good, Robin. Mm -hmm. We're here, yes, Jessica, for five. One, yeah, two, three, mm -hmm. four, five. Robin and Jessica picked heels up in goddess pose. <sighs> Pyramid. From your feet, create your feet in pyramid, left foot forward. Mm-hmm. Look at your right big toe. Grounding your feet down. Softening your toes. Good, Ruby. Yes, Destiny. Twisting triangle from your feet. Pull your feet up into your center, into your abdomen, your hips. Pull your feet up to your hip bones. And twist, one, good, Dev, two, three, four, five, vinyasa, high to low. Uh-huh, upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Good work. Three yogi push ups with your mind and your toes. High push up, low push up. High push up, low push up. So good, Sarah. Yes, Ruby. High push up, low push up. Heck yes, y'all. Oh, yes, heck yes. Get your three yogi push-ups in and then lower all the way down. 
Yeah, lower all the way down when you're complete. Put one ear on your mat and rest for a moment. Rest. Locust pose from your feet. Lift up, hands, heart, feet. Yeah, so good, yeah. Flex your feet, pull your toes towards your kneecaps. Uh-huh, flex your feet, the other flex. Yes, Ruby, so good. We're here for five, one, mm-hmm, two, three, four, five, let it go. Good work, y'all, I see that. Locust, from your feet, rise. One, two, yeah, three, four, five, let it go. Floor bow, bend your knees, feet, ankles, or shins, and then wake up your feet. Ooh, flex them, spread your toes. So good, Robin, yes, Sarah, so good, everybody. For five, one, two, yeah, three, four, five, release. Good work. Floor bow. Last one, other side. Yeah, catch your feet, wake up your feet. So good, Destiny. Everybody for one, two, three, four, five, release. Good work. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. And then come down to your knees <clears throat> and take camel pose from your feet. If your toes are untucked, press the tops of your feet down. If your toes are tucked, really connect to all of your toes being in the earth. And from that connection, lift, lift. One, two, three, four, five. Come out, sit down, untuck your toes, sit on your heels. Good, Jimmy. Camel. Second set from your feet. Connect to your feet and use the connection to your feet to lift everything else up and back from your feet. Feel what your feet are doing. One, two, three, four, five. Come out, sit, rest, rest your body, rest your feet. Mm-hmm. Bridge pose. Roll over onto your back. Ground the four corners of both feet into the floor. And lift your hips up. Feet down, toes light on the earth. Yes, hips high to the ceiling. One, two, three, four, five. Lower down. We have six more bridges or wheels, but come at these from your feet. If you're taking bridge, alternate, lift your toes, alternate, lift your heels, alternate, lift a leg to the ceiling, because we have six of them. And if you take full wheel, alternate lifting your heels, lifting your toes, lifting a leg. Number one of six, rise, bridge or wheel. One, two, three, four, five. Number two, one, two from your feet, four, five. Number three, one, two, three, four, Five, number four, one, 
two, three, four, five. Number five. One, two, three, four, five. Last one to connect to your feet in bridge or wheel. One, two, three, four, five. Lower down. Take reclined butterfly pose and connect all of your toes. Can you feel your pinky toe separate from your big toe? Good, good. Happy baby. Yeah, grab the pinky toe edges of your feet, press the back of your head down. Press your tailbone down. Spread all 10 of your toes. Good, 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 good. Release your feet up to the ceiling. You can see all 10 of your toes. Pulse your fingers towards all 10 of your toes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lower one leg to a hover. Wake up both of your feet. Oh, yes. Pulse for your extended leg. One, two, three, so good, Destiny. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 9, 10, switch legs, keeping your feet alive. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Squeeze your knees into your chest. Wiggle all 10 toes. Crunch them up. Yes. <sighs> Hands under your tailbone. 30, 60 legs from your feet. Then your feet up. Yeah, pull your toes towards your face. Yeah, press up through your heels. Yeah, lower down 30 degrees, 60 degrees. Hover your feet two inches up off the floor. Look up at your toes, see them. Are they hovering? Pull your toes back towards your face. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Head down, legs up. Lower down 30, 60, hover your feet, take them apart and together, feet alive, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Head down, legs up, three more, lower down 30, 60, hover your feet, see your toes, pull them back towards you, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. head down, legs up. Second to last one right here, lower down 30. Yes, reawaken your feet, 60. Hover your feet, see your toes, see your toes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Head down, legs up. Last one, y'all, lower down 30. 60. Hover your feet, see your beautiful toes. Do something with your toes, wake them up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Squeeze your knees into your chest. Yogi bicycles, 30, from your feet, with your feet flexed and alive, like stomping and kicking with each twist. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine thirty. Squeeze your knees in. Rock and roll up and down your spine. High boat. Three high boats. Three low boats. Each one's a three count. From your feet. High boat number one. Rise up. Wake up your feet. One, two, three. Low boat. One, two, three. High boat. One, two, three. Low boat. One, two, three. High boat. One, two, three. Low boat. One, two. 
three and let it go. Good work, y'all. Let it go. Wiggle your toes. Come back to your feet. Soften them. Extend them. Whew. Half pigeon. Half pigeon on your back, on your front. Your choice. Traditional half pigeon, laying forward, press your feet down. Reclined half pigeon, flex your feet and interlace your hands to grab the back side of your left thigh. Mm -hmm. Flex your feet a lot, both of them. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Connecting to your feet in both forms of half pigeon. Both forms of half pigeon. Switch sides and pay close attention to your feet as you move from one side to the other. Press your feet down and flex your feet. Double pigeon or seated figure four. Come at it from your feet. So if you're taking double pigeon, stack your shins. Bring your top ankle to the outside of your bottom knee. Flex your feet a lot. Feel it right here. Flex your feet a lot. Yeah, good, Ruby. Yes, flex your feet so much, so much. Good, Destiny, take your top ankle to the outside of your bottom knee. So make the triangle in your, yes, shorter. Yes, 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 yes. Flex your feet so much. I know you feel it in your hip joints. I totally, I know, I get it. Flex your feet, come at it from your feet. Mm-hmm. We're here for five. One, two, three, four, five. Switch the stack of your shins. Yeah, I know. Recreate top ankle to the outside of your bottom knee, taking your knees just a wee bit closer together. And flex your feet. Yeah, flex your feet a lot. Like really, 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 really flex your feet, I know. Breathe in and breathe out for five. One, 
two, from your feet, three, four, five, frog pose. Face the right long side of your mat, you at home face whichever space you have more for your head and torso. Take frog, fold up the corners of your mat for floor facing frog. You wanna take frog on your back, do that and create right angles. Flex your feet. Flex your feet. Good. And then Ruby, take your hips farther away to Florida Avenue. Bring your hips more this way. Yeah, to create right angles. You'll feel it in your groins. Bring your torso down. Torso down. Crawl down. Flex your feet. Good. And then bring your hips farther away from your heels. So more, more. Press it. Yeah, press more. More, like crawl your chest towards the door. Crawl towards the door. Yeah, 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 oh, more. I know, I know. Bring the block underneath, yes. Bring the block underneath your chest. Yes. And then take your feet out wider. Yes. And then crawl more forward. Yes. Yes, frog, yes. Connect to your big toes. Connect to all 10 of your toes. Alternating, wiggling, pressing them down, spreading them out. I know frog is big, is big. Frog is big sensations. Shift your attention from the big sensations you feel to the little toes on your feet. Yeah, feel the big sensations. Yeah, acknowledge them, like, yep, this is a powerful pose. I'm feeling a lot of stuff here and then send the spotlight of your attention out to your toes. And keep reconnecting. Feel what you feel, and then put your attention on your little toes. Feel what you feel. Send your attention out to your toes, alternating. Feel what you feel. And then connect to your toes. For 60 more seconds. Feel what you feel. Yeah, acknowledge it. Sensation. And then feel your toes. Feel the big stuff. Move out to the little stuff. Feel. Yeah, moving in and out, big stuff to little stuff, big stuff to little stuff. Big sensations, little toes. 30 seconds. So good, Ruby. Yes, I see that. Big stuff, little stuff. Feel the big stuff, feel the little stuff. Feel the big stuff, mm-hmm. Feel the little stuff. Good work. Slowly wiggle your way out of frog. Slowly. Good, that's me. Slowly make your way to seated single leg extension. Good. And the toes on the extended leg, look at them, see them, spread them. Soften them, point them, get connected to what your right extended leg is doing. The foot, the toes on your extended leg. Maybe it's your right, maybe it's your left. Get connected to them. One, two, three, four, five. Switch sides. And get really connected to the toes on your extended leg. Point, flex, spread, soften. One, two, three, four, five. Seated forward fold. Press both of your legs out. See your toes, wiggle your toes, spread them, point them, flex them. Fold forward. One, 
two, three, four, five. Reverse tabletop, ground your feet into the floor. <coughs> Lift your hips up to the ceiling. See the back wall, press your feet down, wiggle your toes. One, two, three, four, so good. Five, lower all the way down, fish pose. Bring your forearms down, point your toes, and then flex your toes, so floint, pointed little Barbie feet, like on your tippy toes. Now pull your toes back towards your face as you point your toes away from you. Yes, the floint, the little ballerina floint. Yes, one, two, three, four, five. Good, come up and out of fish, and then pick an inversion. Waterfall pose, block under your tailbone, legs to the ceiling. Any other inversion variation you want to take, do that. Do that. We are here for 60 seconds. 60 seconds to get your toes up above your heart. If you were in shoulder stand, those of you at home, you would like to take plow. Take your toes over your head, Jessica and Destiny, if you would like. No pressure. If you would like to take ear pinning pose, bend your knees and bring your knees by your ears for ear pinning pose. And then everyone slowly Make your way down out of your inversion, slowly, controlled. Good, take a full body stretch after taking the block out from underneath you, stretch out. Point your feet, flex your feet, reach your fingers. And then take one knee into your chest or both knees and take a supine twist. You wanna take both knees, do that. And here in the supine twist, Soften everything. Soften your toes, your shins, your thighs, your glutes, the muscles in your rib cage, your shoulders, arms, forearms, hands, and fingers. Soften. Switch sides. Soften from the toes on your feet to the fingers on your hands. Soften. Supta Baddha Konasana, recline butterfly pose. Once again, connect all of your toes to all of your toes and discern big toe from pinky toe and all the little baby toes in between. Good. And take your legs out long. Find the corners of your mat with your heels. And then take your feet out wider, off the edges of your mat. Scrunch up your toes. Let them go. And prepare your body for stillness. Take in a huge breath. Sigh it out. And I'll come around and I'll place a cool lavender towel on your forehead. If this is something you do not want, bring one hand to your belly. I see you. Thank you.
wiggle your toes. Scrunch up your toes, spread them back out. Wiggle your fingers, clench up your fists, extend your fingers. And roll to your favorite side when you are ready. And then make your way to a simple crisscross applesauce seat at the top of your mat. Bring your hands to heart center. Once again, reconnect to your feet, wiggle your toes. And we'll seal this practice of finding neutral territory through our feet with the sound of three ohms. thumb knuckles to your forehead center lift your chin towards the heavens and from right here invite in whatever it is you need to allow yourself to feel whatever it is you need to feel so that you can seek neutral ground invite it in and together we bow thank you jen thank you noel robin sarah ruby jimmy dev jen and destiny everybody give yourself a big round of applause there's a thousand things you could have done but you came to your mat thank you so much for being here